Let's do this. Raz can now levitate and he has firepower. With these tools, these psychic tools, we should be well equipped to re-enter the brain tumbler and discover what's happened to Dogen Bull's brain. Also Frankie's brain and Kitty's brain. Basically somebody's going around stealing brains and that's not okay. Okay, I'm a certified levitator now. Ready to roll. Hmm, I've been running some tests. It seems that the sensitive circuitry of the brain tumbler is picking up too much psychic interference to be safe. The thoughts of some other entity are interlacing with yours at a dangerous level, which explains many of the strange things you've seen. Uh -huh. I must call off the experiments until we know more. Sasha, there's no time. I think my vision about Dogen came true. I'm worried it's gonna happen to the others if we don't get to the bottom of this quick. But we don't know where the foreign projections are coming from yet. Is there a faster way to find out than sending me in there to investigate? Here we go. So, more doors are opening up in this place. Are these to Mia's brain? Well, you can see I've got all the vaults and baggage tags. Uh, the brain tumbler, which is where I want to actually go. And Sasha's should be open again once now. Yep, I could go back into Sasha's mind, though he probably wouldn't like that very much. But let's stay on target. Right. Here we are. Oop. Sensors. <coughs> Presumably, these sensors are actually from the mind of uh, whoever else's brain is interfacing with that of Raz. But the new triple shot thing handily takes care of them. And we can now probably get up to this boat. Hey! I can float to a boat. Hmm. I really like how um, all the powers illuminate things. But actually, that's not the end of the story, is it? Because it looks like there's actually some way to go over there. Oh, uh, no, not quite. Hmm. There's the bunny again. Oh, give me that figment, 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 figment. Give, fig, fuck, fuckment. Oh, I want it. But I didn't get it. Okay, what I was saying was... Oh, it looked like, uh, beyond the boot, there was actually somewhere else, some way to get up to other parts of the level. I could have sworn when we were last here I saw things. Hmm. Maybe I did not see things. Maybe. Okay. I'll check it out one more time, just in case. Yeah, this appears to be the end of the line, I guess. Well, all right. I better climb that tower and meet this dentist. The good news is nothing can stop me now. Can't get a good grip. At least not if I have the power of pyrokinesis. Ah, big explosions now. Why a rabbit, anyway? Ah, oh, that's right, I've got to sort of activate it. Here we go! Why are you screaming? Alright, I remember! Ooh, 
you. Oh, good boy. There's that pesky brain. Here's a tissue. Now, don't you feel better, my dear lad? TV? Of course. Right here. And this bad tooth. We'll just drop it in the old garbage chute. Now, don't you solid foods for six hours. What? Really? But this is just a dream, right? TV. I mean, I know Dogen's not really here, he's in the TV room. TV. I like how the people with removed brains only care about TV and hacky sack. all this then blueprints Oh crap. So. A tank, a weapon powered by brains. Now that is a threat worthy of a psychonaut. Can I destroy it? It's having no effect, my god. How about pyrokinesis? Ah, uh, okay. Let's move faster here. So how do I actually break this thing? Maybe if I can get up to it. No, that didn't work. Ah, uh, it's covered in spikes. Oh! I think that was exposing a sort of vulnerable spot there. So I need to wait until it does that again. It looks like it fires little question mark things at times. Hey! Right, this should be easy to beat. As long as I keep hiding when it's actually firing and uh, shoot whenever it exposes its non-brain bit. Third-person camera is really useful at times like this. All good protagonists should have one. Of course, this is just uh, a blueprint. Oh, what? oh my God! What? Grenade. Oh, I see. Hey. Oh, okay. So. When the confusion grenade hits you, it reverses your controls. This is inconvenient. You don't want that to happen. Yeah. Of course, this is just a blueprint. In fact, it's a dream of a blueprint. Presumably, if one of these tanks was built for real, it would be more dangerous. Smash. 
Or maybe it would be just as easy to destroy for a trained Psychonaut. Which Rez is not. Yeah, he's totally going to be. I like how the music has become slightly more military, reminiscent of uh, basic braining, since we are fighting a tank. Um, it looks like while you're confused, you also can't maintain mental lock very easily. Otherwise, it would kind of be a way around confusion. Got you. All right. Unfortunately, this. Oh, what? 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 All right. It's time for the palm. Oh, it wasn't time for the palm bomb. Ow. Confusion. This is tough. Almost. But not quite. Alright, let's do it better this time. I wonder if I should actually be using ranged attacks. No, it seems to be immune to those. I should not have jumped into that. That was the wrong decision. What I should probably be using is levitation to move faster. And jump higher. Yep, that's the way to do it. Sorry, I had to abort the experiment. Something unbelievably urgent has come up and I must leave immediately. I know! You'll never believe- Hold that thought. In a rush. Official Psychonaut's business. Wait! So is this! Official Psychonaut, eh? You forgot your- Hmm. Okay. Now, if you didn't hey, recognize that, that corridor- room. Yeah. I know! It's from Oleander's mind. I think I was in the coach's dream that whole time. Ever since I stepped through the static in the caravan, it felt funny. I knew I wasn't obsessed with meat. But Maury is. And was stealing psychic brains to arm a fleet of deadly tanks, apparently. I've got to tell Lily. She's waiting for me down by the boathouse. Down by the... water? Uh-oh. Man a hurry. What does Krullin know about the leak that he hasn't been saying? All right. I've got to head to the beach immediately in the next episode.